Welcome to today's reading from the Our Daily Bread devotional. I'm Elisa Morgan, and I titled it, Happy Thanksgiving. A study by psychologist Robert Emmons divided volunteers into three groups that each made weekly entries in journals. One group wrote five things they were grateful for. One described five daily hassles, and a control group listed five events that had impacted them in a small way. The results of the study revealed that those in the gratitude group felt better about their lives overall, were more optimistic about the future, and reported fewer health problems. Giving thanks has a way of changing the way we look at life. Thanksgiving can even make us happier. The Bible has long extolled the benefits of giving thanks to God, as doing so reminds us of His character. The Psalms repeatedly call God's people to give Him thanks because the Lord is good and His love endures forever, and to thank Him for His unfailing love and wonderful deeds. As the Apostle Paul closed his letter to the Philippians, the letter itself a kind of a thank you note to a church that had supported him, he linked thankful prayers with the peace of God which transcends all understanding. When we focus on God and His goodness, we find that we can pray without anxiety, in every situation, with thanksgiving. Giving thanks brings us a peace that uniquely guards our hearts and minds and changes the way we look at life. A heart full of gratitude nurtures a spirit of joy. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from Philippians chapter 4, verses 4 through 7. Rejoice in the Lord always. I will say it again. Rejoice! Let your gentleness be evident to all. The Lord is near. Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. And the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. Let's pray. Father in heaven, where we see problems, grant us a spirit of gratitude and grateful praise. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thanks for listening today. My name is Elisa Morgan, and today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.